Hi, I'm Bert. I'm Detective Peters. We're here to t talk to you about this new uh, edition that our little brother Tyler got uh, of the movie Creep Show 2. It's this new DVD release. He got it off of eBay. Um, and for some reason, I guess the special features included, which I think are pretty cool, are uh, there's a lot of misspellings on the box, and it has uh, no trailer or anything. Um, and no sort of insert or anything no. extra. No, but the quality, it. get this, the quality of the movie is just as good as my old VHS copy. And it's amazing. And so it's sort of a throwback to back when the 80s, when all we had were VCRs and video cassette tapes. Also, if I can move the camera closer, you can see on the menu it says Strat Movie. It's, it's cool to see these uh, DVD distributors doing things that are more original. Yeah, it's and unique. more of their own style. I mean, uh, this box. So I definitely give them kudos for that. I think that was a great touch. The Creek. A rotting ghoul waits behind young Billy at the newsstand for the latest issue of The Creep Show comic book. As Billy runs to keep out of the clutches of the town bullies, the creep follows him, picking up his scattered comic book pages. Dramatized are three gruesome, three gruesome. One it's, word, that's it's, one word. It's one word. How much did you pay for that copy of that DVD? I think like $30. <laughs> well worth every penny, I'm sure. Do you regret that purchase at all? Kind of, yeah. <laughs> why did you uh, buy it then? I mean, why, we were just talking about how great it was. I mean, didn't that even convince you a little? Well, they never... Like, I wanted to get the special edition, and um, they never told me what edition I was going to get. In. So I, I was kind of mad. A cigar store wooden Indian comes to life to revenge the store's owners brutal murder at the hands of three punks. Now I want to show, there's a very curious intro to the movie. I don't know about you, but top ten new media productions and that really kick-ass theme song makes me, leads me to believe that this is, this is a really, really, you know, well-to-do company that knows, knows how to distribute, uh, Find sent works of art. And after such a captivating, a uh, beautifully animated intro segment, I mean, I feel pumped. I'm ready to watch the movie. Uh, I'm ready. We I just mean, watched it, but I will watch it again. We should. And well, again, if yes. we watch the intro, every time you watch the intro, you want to see the movie. Yeah. So that's what it is an oil slick. I wondered what that thing was. Me too. I mean, like, gave it, it all away on the Big and box. spongy. It's, it's it was nice. kind of oily, it's but. It's good to have a guy. Oh, and there's only six chapters, but you know, you don't even need six chapters. And they, you know, go, they pop up at random points in the film. I think I cried, actually, when I got it. How old were you when you got it? <laughs> Twelve. And I cried because it's a threat movie. Finally, Little Billy's troubles in when he leaves the bullies in the giant patch of the flight so it spoils the ending for us right on the back. It says that the bullies are eaten by Venus flytraps. But like, you know, it's a guide, though. It's like, it, you read it, this it's a guide. afterwards. Yeah, you after. watch the movie first, and you read the summary afterward. Yeah. So it's not to ruin the experience. You should so. watch it. We give it two thumbs up. Yeah. People die. There are bare breasts exposed. Bare breasts. So. Uh, a lot of bare breasts, actually. Two. See, I cried, too, but they were tears of joy. See, that's that's the difference. I think I actually cried for like two hours straight. 